It's a, you know, a crazy amount of setups to get your legs. Like I said, all you got to do is put weight on his hands, you can spiral, bar ankle, bar knee. Anytime you break them down, they're trying to build back to their base, no weight's on their hands. And you can slip a leg. Okay, uh, I'm just going to use one setup today to save time. Um, like I said, do not start back right up close to him with your butt on your uh, heels. I want to back up. I'm going to drive him forward. So I point my knee towards his butt where I'm going to drive him. If I, I ride my right leg, so I'm going to start on the right side. Anytime I go inside his elbow, I go thumb outside. Thumb outside. So I'm going to go inside his elbow. If I'm going to chop, then I go fingers outside. I'm, go, I'm going inside, thumb outside. Knee pointed towards his butt. I'm just going to make a fist with both hands and go inside his thighs. Now, I'm not keeping my elbows out. I'm just put my fist, my fist inside his thighs. My arms straight. That's going to pinch his ribs. That's going to help carry his whole weight forward. All right, so I'm going double thigh pry, and I straighten my arms. That pinches his ribs. Here. Get that weight forward, and I just slide my boot in. Now, I don't want to lace. You're not starting out with the lace. There's several reasons I do this. If I lace, it pulls my hip down. Also, if I lace, when he mule kicks, it's going to knock your leg out. It twists your ankle. Okay, if I just have my boot in, he mule kicks, I keep my heel tight. Again, again, just keep my heel tight. He's not going to get my leg out when I just have a boot. If I lace, he can mule kick, twist your ankle, and get it out. All right, also, if I lace, you're pretty much waiting on him to do something. So I, I can't drive off that toe now. Whenever I have my boot in, I can put pressure on him. That toe's on the mat. I can use that to drive. Alright, so there is a time to lace and secure his leg, but right when you put your leg in, it's not in. So I don't want to see any laces. Just short boot. If I was going to sit on top of it, that's all it is. So even if you have short legs, it's a lot of I have two short legs to ride legs. Not a boot. Setting on top, I put the inside of my heel inside his thigh. That's it. That's a boot. That's all we're doing right now. Alright, the first thing we're going to work on is reaction leg riding, so we're going to react. Uh, you got to be ready if you throw a leg in and he sits one way or another. The first one is what a lot of people learn as a defense, is to try to set you to your butt, and then he's going to try to get his hips away, sit to your butt, and they try to scoot down, right, get their hips away, get under your leg, things like that. Okay, as soon as he sits, he's going to be my power hat, it's there, he's got to take it. Okay, you can't wait though. So, double thigh fry, get that weight forward, slide my boot in. Now, hold on. I always go hook. I get to my hook into it. It's the same, it's just as good as your end. A lot of people uh, coach, teach cross body, it's always elbow and arm, pit, elbow and arm. Pit. That's fine if I'm trying to kill a teen or something like that. Besides that, I want my power hat. So, my body doesn't move, it's just my arms. I'm not getting my hook and bringing my body over here in bad position. I'm still laying across his body. I just replace my elbow with my hook, or my arm on top of his head. So now when he sits me to my butt, I'm walking it instantly to my chest, driving straight to the mat. Good. Same position, guys. Head away, elbow two. What do I do now? What? Climb the wall. Okay? Get our pin. So, this is real similar to our crackdown, so we're not going to work very long. Get out there and get two or three reps in each guy. Use him just, uh, you know, a good setup. Double thigh pry. My knee's pointed towards the direction I want to drive. I'm heavy chested. Double thigh pry. Get that weight forward. Just like a spiral. I got to come off my knee and run it. It's not something you can hit half hearted. Okay? I'm coming out to the side, on my toes, getting that weight forward. Slide my boot in. He sends me to my butt, lock it to my chest, instantly driving off that other leg, secure it, elbow to me, head away. Once I get my back, my leg up on the elbow, find the wall and finish it. You good? Alright, let's try it. One, two, three. We got seven out.